President Donald Trump returns to Cincinnati with a couple of topics on his mind. He talked a bit about health care reform, but the main reason for his visit is to sell his infrastructure improvement plan. Local 12's Jeff Hirsch covered the speech at Rivertown Marina and is live with highlights and reaction. Jeff? Well, good evening. The president is talking about rebuilding the four R's, roads, rivers, runways, and rails. And of course, we were on the Ohio River, so that was a big part of his focus today in discussing his $1 million infrastructure improvement proposal. One trillion, I should say. About 400 invited guests were here, representatives of some energy and agricultural and river transportation companies, some labor leaders, and there were workers. Heard the president say that, that streamlined regulation will mean projects get completed faster, and that means more jobs. Not only are we going to repair much of the depleted infrastructure, but we're going to create brand new projects that excite and inspire, because that is what a great country does that is what a great country has to do. America wants to build. It doesn't get much better when the president says he's going to give steel industry some help, and that's what we need. We drastically need that with the, uh, the tariffs and that, and the, I'd like to see him stop uh, foreign steel altogether, but that's what we're going to need to get this going and to reinvest in America using American-made products with American labor. Obviously, we're in a very, very partisan age, but infrastructure could be one area where Democrats and Republicans might find some common ground. But the devil is in the details, and those are still, well, we're still waiting for them. Live along the river, Jeff Hirsch, Local 12 News, back to you. All right, Jeff, thanks for all your coverage. After his speech, President Trump returned to Lincoln, and Air Force One took off from there. He's back at the White House tonight.